This week, Starbucks celebrated its 50th anniversary. Also celebrating its 50th anniversary, the turkey bacon sandwich in the display case. <laughs> 15 million doses of the Johnson & Johnson vaccine have been delayed following an ingredient mix-up at the factory. But the good news is, now your shampoo might cure COVID. <laughs> Pfizer also said that its COVID vaccine is safe and effective for teens aged 12 to 15. Well, that's a relief, said Matt Gates. <laughs> The U.S. men's soccer team failed to qualify for the Olympics for the third time in a row. But, fellas, keep your heads up and remember that win or lose, you will always get paid more than the women's team. <laughs> a New Jersey woman who posts pictures of herself rock climbing while naked says that it is not pornographic, but I don't know, that rock looks pretty hard. <laughs> The airline industry is testing a virus-killing robot that uses ultraviolet light to disinfect planes. Not to be outdone, Spirit Airlines just taped a glow stick to a Roomba. <laughs> Yesterday was National Peanut Butter Day and National Ferret Day, and I celebrated both with a very, very dangerous trick. <laughs> <laughs> A woman in Taiwan who thought her boyfriend was cheating cut off his penis and flushed it down the toilet. I'm sorry, thought he was cheating? 